uh, Connor, you somehow gathered yourselves to deliver an excellent performance, but did you spend the 90 minutes worried about your mate? Massively, massively. Uh, this one we didn't like it when it happened. It was something you knew straight away. And this one we hope David Luiz is okay as well. It was a it was a horrible clash ahead. This happens in football, but you don't like to see it. I think both sets of teams went out and then played properly. Do you know what I mean? Done it right. It was it was a tough thing that happened, and he's with the right people, and that's the most important thing. But we just hope and pray that. Everything's OK because he's the one we're thinking about right now. You were one of the first on the scene. Did you just know straight away from the way he landed, from the sound, that he's in trouble here? Yeah, massively, massively. And I was at the, I was at the front just behind him, so I, I jumped with them as well. And you, you heard it, and as they dropped, obviously he was on his side. And I think it was important we kept him on his side. Do you know what I mean? Uh, and then you get the doctors on different things. But, listen, it's, it's something we never want to see, especially with one of our teammates or with anybody within the Premier League because that's what can happen. So... I hope and I pray that everything's okay because, like I said, that is the one thing that matters today. We've got a fantastic result, but the one thing that matters is making sure that uh, Raul and David Luiz are, are both okay. In, in that instance, I suppose football and rivalry and all that just goes out the window. <coughs> so, how difficult is it then to re refocus the team? It was partly your job as captain. How do you gather yourselves to do what you did? You've got to because you've got an hour, well, more than an hour, whatever it was, 80 minutes left of, left of a game. I think you've got to. and thing is you go and play and, and hope you get the win for Raul and for, for what he does for us so listen like I said the, the most important thing today is hoping that them two players are okay because we know David Luiz come off at half time as well but from our point of view is like I said he's just hoping and praying that he's alright but he'll be the right people now and that's the most important thing for us yeah, I don't want to pry too much but I guess it's one of the first things you ask at half time how yeah. is he is there anything yeah. you can say he's in the hospital and by all accounts he's He's awake and he's breathing, and that's the one thing we're looking at. Listen, I don't know too much because I've not been there, but the first question we asked when we went in was, was how, how's Raul? Because, like you said, people's health and people's heads and bodies come more to the forefront in these situations. So it's important now we, we remember the game, but most importantly we get Raul sorted because it's a, it's a massive collision he's had there. Yeah, I mean, look, it almost doesn't feel right to ask about the football. <clears throat> But from that point on, actually before that, how well did you do as a team? Massive, massive. Listen, we're, we're trying to get better, we're trying to evolve. I think you can see that. I think you can see the club trying to move in the right direction. It's something we need to move along with as players. Listen, we're, we're enjoying playing, we're enjoying learning and learning new things off our manager. And it's important we carry on, listen, to come here and win. It's no mean feat. It's, it, it's a fantastic result because you come to the Emirates and you don't often get results here and not many teams come here and get results. So it's huge for us. It's something we can take forward and, and I just look at the performance and feel like we've done quite well. Thank you. No problem. Thank you, well fellas. Done.